Sugar, how you get so fly? Welcome back to another video guys. Today's Q&A is going to be a viewer question from Patrick. He writes in asking, I'm 34 years old, I do push workouts every day from home and I have a 35 pound dumbbell. It's got me in really great shape for the past two years but tell me what's good to eat and when. Like how much to eat, what kind of food, I need tips. And he sends in a picture of himself, so I'll throw that up here so you guys can kind of see. But basically, this guy is looking like he's in really great shape. He's really lean, and he's clearly been working out. He has a pump here. And here's that 35-pound dumbbell that he was talking about. <laughs> but yeah, so first of all, congrats, man. Honestly, you've made a lot of progress, especially considering that you're just training from home with nothing but a 35 pound dumbbell. So great work, man. What that tells me as a coach is that you're motivated and committed. It tells me that you're training intense and it tells me that you're consistent with your workouts. And those are the most important things in any training program. He says that he works out every morning when he wakes up and he's wondering what to eat around his training so yeah thank you for the question man um congrats on the progress you made so far but once you get your diet in check you are going to make significantly more gains like you're going to notice your physique level up once you get your diet in check okay so here's what you need to do four meals per day minimum Ideally five or six, but four meals per day minimum, evenly split up throughout the day. Every meal consists of one protein and one carb source together. Every meal four times per day minimum, ideally five or six. What the protein source and carb source are don't matter so much. For example, for the protein source, you could have chicken, steak, ground beef or ground turkey, turkey, lunch meat, fish, crab, eggs, protein powder, anything. And same goes for the carbs. You could have potato, sweet potato, rice, brown rice, oatmeal, bread, bagels, fruits, sugars, Pop-Tarts. It does not matter. What matters is that you're having one protein, one carb, four to six times per day, evenly split up throughout the day. That's most important okay ideally we want the protein to have 30 grams minimum per meal so like one chicken breast is about 30 grams you want to have that every meal as a minimum um in terms of when to eat the food you ideally will be splitting it up evenly throughout your day and one to two hours before you train so having a well-balanced meal one to two hours before you train is going to help give you better workouts you're going to have more energy be able to push yourself harder and you're going to notice better pumps and more vascularity too so definitely try to get a good meal in one or two hours before you train i know that you said you train every morning when you wake up so it's not clear whether or not you're training fasted but for those of you out there who are training fasted right when you wake up in the morning, it's very, very important that you have a really big meal right before you go to bed. And that's gonna help give you better workouts and it's also gonna help preserve your muscle because what we don't wanna have happen is when we're at the gym working out, our body's actually breaking down our own muscle and using it for energy for the workouts. So one thing that you guys can try is called um, BCAs, branched chain amino acids. It's a really popular supplement out there and basically what it does is it acts like a shield for all your muscle and protects it from your body so that your body doesn't break it down and use it for energy. So that's it man, in summary what you gotta do to get your diet in check is four meals per day minimum, one carb and one protein every meal, 
and 30 grams of protein minimum every meal. On top of that, since you're training in the morning, try to get that big meal in right before you go to bed. And then also you can consider using branch chain amino acids to help preserve a little bit more muscle mass over the long run. And that's it, man. Once you get that in check, you're gonna notice your, your physique really level up because you're already training hard and you're being consistent. So once you get the diet in check, you're gonna have all the pieces of the puzzle in place and progress is gonna explode. So I hope that helps. If you guys found this message helpful at all, I really appreciate if you could leave a comment or a like down below because it helps us grow the channel. And if you are interested in getting some coaching, I'm currently accepting clients. You can um, click the link down below on my website and book a free 30 minute intro session. And we can figure out what training program works best for you. That's it guys, I hope you enjoyed the content and I'll see you in the next video. Peace.